Oh boy, two, oh, two megabytes of updates? This is gonna kill me. <laughs> this is the Xbox experience. There are people, can I like, oh. This isn't a game. We are doing a very different stream today. We are doing a nostalgia stream. I have an ancient thing ripped out from the minds of my storage. Look at this ancient thing. I got an Xbox, my old Xbox 360. So the thing with nostalgia, right? I could go back to my actual childhood. I could go from the age of four to the age of 10 and go through the old Nintendo games I actually played as a child. That is the real nostalgia stuff, you know, the early 2000s kind of things. But that's still... Mm, modern, you know? When people talk nostalgia, they go back to those old Nintendo games. They go back to the GameCube, you know? That is what is the new... You know, I guess everyone's really on the Nintendo 64. We're slowly getting into the GameCube generation. If I was to play... Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door, it would be nostalgic. But people still do that. People still speedrun that game. They still do, I guess they speedrun every game, but everything's still relevant, right? It's not new to be playing old Nintendo games. But there is a generation that is, at least in the circles I know, skipped, yeah? Because it's fairly new, but now it's become old. Obviously, time passes like that. So I'm not going back to the early 2000s, I'm going to 2010. I started making Nintendo Pikmin content when I was 15 in 2012. I think it was July 2012 or something like that. But just before that uh, that time, for about two, maybe three years, I was playing a whole different type of game. I played Nintendo games from the age of four to the age of 10, and then from the age of, or to I guess the age of 12, and then to the age of 12 to the age of 15, I played Xbox 360 games. I got onto the First person shooter hype because every all of my friends played that. Nobody played Pokemon. What are you, a loser? So I had a real phase. It was my emo phase, as I call it. My rebellious, swearing, grumpy phase of getting angry at people with new tubes online. I haven't played these games in a decade. Just less than a decade. So I wanted to revisit them now for a couple of hours. We have one game that I have re I've re-bought on PC, on Steam. And then we have three... Old school physical copies from what I actually used to own back in the day. So these are as old as when I bought them, basically. I mean, this one's, this one's metal, you know? You might recognize them, you might not. If you do, you can come join the Nostalgia Fate. Maybe you still play these games. These are the collections of Xbox 360 games we have to play today. I kind of got a plan of what I'm playing, but I mean, if there's a massive demand for Halo 4 at the bottom here, which I don't think I've even played, we can do. Um, in fact, let's... Oh, that would be cool. Hold on. Ugh. Sofa screwdriver. Background screwdriver. Look at this setup. This is pro aesthetics. Masterpiece. There we go. That's some, some quality right Huzzah! We can either have Battlefield Bad Company 2, which I used to play all the time as a kid, but only on Xbox 360 that was. On PC, there are more players, so I bought it on Steam to do. Alternatively, we can play some Black Ops. I'm not as big of a fan of the online, but it does have zombies, which I am a big fan of. In the bottom of our pack, second from the bottom, we have World at War, so we could play classic Call of Duty zombies. I did like Call of Duty back in the day. I joined in the Modern Warfare 2 phase, then went back to COD 4, then played World at War. Didn't like Black Ops' online, but I liked the zombies. Then Modern Warfare 3 came out and I was moving on to Pikmin, I think, by that point. And then my Black Ops 2, I had never planned to buy until my friend was like, You gotta play with us, buy Black Ops 2! And then I did, and two days later he was done with Black Ops 2, so I was just left with the remains. I, I the, it was more zombies though, so there's that. We do also have Halo Reach. Uh, do we have Halo 3? No. No, we don't. We used to have Halo 3. I guess I must have traded it for a new Wii U game or something. Who knows? 
Uh, we have Halo 4 there, and we have Halo Wars. Haven't played either, so I'll stick to what I know. Halo Reach, we can play a little bit of that. And then we have Modern Warfare 2. Oh, unfortunately, we are not doing Nintendo during this nostalgia stream, just because Nintendo's been done with the nostalgia thing. They, they live off of nostalgia. That is their genre. Um... Well, that was something. I, uh, uh, the entire computer just froze. I didn't even touch anything. I was just talking. I don't know how many of you uh, actually had a uh, an Xbox 360. I don't know if you had it back in the day, but here's what it looks like now. Wow. Let us start with Call of Duty Black Ops because it's plugged in. No, I want Halo Reach. I want Halo Reach first. It's a way it can it can ease us in. All right. I have decided. I have spoken. Oh boy, two, oh, two megabytes of updates? This is gonna kill me. <laughs> this is the Xbox experience. Feeling it already. Uh, this is what the real a last generation experience is, apparently. You notice how the light's getting darker and darker now that we've gone past sunset? Um, we have a new change of plan. Something that actually will work this time. So, change of plan. There, this last stream lasted 10 minutes. The one before that, 20. So this might have only five. There's one defining difference that has happened from that. And that is that I took out my ethernet cable from my computer, put it in my Xbox. So the internet couldn't stomach it. So I've switched it back. Hopefully we will stick with it. So with that in mind, my Xbox 360 no longer has internet. It can't connect Wi-Fi wirelessly to my router for some reason. So Halo Reach is out of question. Modern Warfare 2 is out of the question because I want to have the multiplayer experiences. All that's left is Black Ops. And I would like to try a little bit of Xbox 360 stuff before the PC stuff. So we're going to try and play Zombies solo and see where it goes. All right. <laughs> if, uh, if this does end up being saved as a VOD and a stream highlight, the editor's gonna have a fun time mashing all of this together. Third time's a charm. And then if this crashes, we'll try one final fourth time to get Battlefield Bad Company 2. Otherwise, it will be a crash for all four games. You know, four times, that's how I'll accept it. Let us just play some zombies. That's all I care about. Remember these old days? This was very cool back in the day. Let's just play some zombies. It's up to you, miss. It's all up to Okay, you. Mr. Bold Man. Solo, please. Oh, wow, we actually have them all. Of course we do. It's my old Xbox. We have Kina de Toten, 5, Dead Ops Arcade. Barely remember that. Nak de Untoten, Verok, Shino Numa, Dariz, Ascension, Call of the Dead, Shangri La, and the Moon. I remember all of these. This is nostalgia stuff. Oh, how. <laughs> it's a nostalgia stream that's crashed twice. It is. That's what's nostalgic. Do you not remember technology issues? Back in the day? Oh man, my sensitivity is way too high. I yeah, very high. No thanks. I'm an old school. Also, okay, I think that's fine. Oh, I remember being obsessed about every element of this. Because like I remember, I would I loved the jingles of all of the machines you could get. They're all different perks that give you like upgrades that make the gameplay better. I remember that you're supposed to shoot. You could do like round one. You could just kill them with a knife and it gets you more points, but you would go one, two, three, four. I think I missed some of those. And then do it and you get the maximum points. You penetrate through multiple zombies at the same time. That was the old thing. Yeah, I remember that. You can dive in Black Ops and Black Ops only. Also, you could always manipulate these zombies. I don't think they're as easy to do that in later games. Oh man, I might play a little bit of all of these, honestly. We will see. Uh, I don't actually know how long, like, how long this will go. You see that? Get two points. It's on PS3 too. I wanted to do all four, but it won't really let me. Oh well. Round three, I could probably do with not a knife. If I move on, I should move on. Let's just go this way. Not the way I actually remember too well. Um. Right, let's just open a bunch. Like go round to the back of the theatre. I don't know how much the loot. Loot box? Random box? Maybe it was just called random box. I do not want a shotgun. Uh, that's pretty... Yeah, I like this. What's this, MP40? I thought it was MP4. 
Close enough. Is that how- does the, uh- oh, hey, thanks for the ammo. Max ammo! Um, alright. Uh, while you're hanging about, I want to just see what there is. Random box could show up there. Wasn't a big fan of whatever that weapon was. You must turn on the power first. Fine. Power's like here, isn't it? I think? This is the back of the stage. Can I use this? I don't remember that. Can I go in here? Oh. I don't remember this. Oh, maybe it's part of like an Easter egg thing. And you can build it later, I'm guessing. Like, follow the electricity, maybe? Man, I do not know. Oh well. Uh, let's look for this random box, because that's part of the fun. Um, maybe I'll get a... Uh... I don't have the... He I don't think I have the, the credits? Currency? I don't know what this thing's called. Here, let me rebuild some buildings, and then we'll come around to it. But no, there is a whole big... Oh, oh, hole. Oh. Does it, like, teleport me here? Oh, okay. That's not as fun. Not as crazy as I thought it would be. Oh, these are traps. Yes. Okay. Cool. Give me the next round, please. Can I just, like, does this cost money? Ah. Oh. Never mind. I didn't think it would take me up here. <gasps> to pack a punch briefly. That's cool. But then you could lose your weapon if you disappear it too quickly. Because it's like a time limit, isn't it? Yeah. Don't make that mistake. Oh, he doesn't know where to go. Sorry, buddy. We'll be with you in a sec. Let's see if we can't get some more points this round. And then towards the end of that round, only round five, it's not that crazy. We will uh, we'll then go and see the rest of the spots, get some weapons, and then crazy again. What else was going on in 2010? Like, I don't know, what's going on in this, in this time period? I do not remember. Oh yes, those things. I forgot, oh yes, and they like, cause an explosion I guess? Oh, they leave like poison. Is that what I'm seeing right? Oh, but not if you knife them. Ah. Look at me relearning all the mechanics. be kind of nerve-wracking to do this solo. Like, with friends, you get to hang out and talk and, you know, make fun the whole time. Coordinate, you know? Oh, the blur is not my camera recording, it's it's them. The green fog. Alright, we've got a lot of points. Let's let's run around a bit more. I really just went the wrong way, didn't I? Should have What? That's like one or two doors this way and would have got it. Typical. <gasps> Hi! Ooh, well, that's us sorted for the game. Considering I don't plan to go too crazy long on this uh, map. We've now seen essentially everything. I don't know the best place to stand. I think people used to do, what was it, trains is what they called it. You know, roop, rooping people around here. We'll make it work. Um, I won't get a pack of juggernaut even. I'll upgrade my, my weapon because I've learned how to. And go from there. I remember this. Oh, I have to reprint it? Oh, fun. Yes, what was this demo dog round? I can't remember what they're called. Doesn't make me think of stranger things, but. Zombie dogs! Every seven rounds? I thought it was like every five. I don't know how it works. Oh, was that them done? Wow, I didn't realize I hit two at once. Oh, I think this is... I can hear the thing again. Oh, hello. Can I have that, please? Thanks, buddy. Oh. 5,000? Alright, that makes sense. I appreciate the crowding, like the hoardingness. That's what I like about zombies the most. Right. I might start ending, like, this segment here off soon. Like, I'm not crazy invested in how well this game goes. And again, we're getting through. Let's up, let's power punch, pack a punch, because we can. But let's like do the pistol, ironically. We've got a, the best weapon in the game, but we'll go with pistol. Sure. Why not? Ah, oh, teleport's cooling down. Always something. Oh, 
Oh, hi, buddies. Well. Where do they run off to? Why? Oh, that's where you get the points. There we go. I wasn't planning to stay around that long because I was like, well, we've seen enough of this. What I will do next, maybe, is we'll try... That was the very first level. I won't go through every single one in the world. Let's get to, like, the last one because I was dropping off at this point. Kind of. I remember playing it a lot less than the, uh, the first ones. I appreciate, like, the change in map design, though, with the Pack-a-Punch being where you spawn. That's pretty, like... Not ballsy, but it's new. Oh wow, they come out of the ground? That's cool. Yeah, I do not remember this map as well. I do remember the weapon. Was it like... I don't know if... No, it wasn't the thunder gun, I don't think. It was like the microwave gun. You know, it cooks them from the inside or something. Did you get left behind here? Or is it just saying you can do this whenever you want? Oh, no, no, I was supposed to... Well... Cool. I forgot how you breathe. How do you breathe? How do you breathe in here? Ah, this. Ooh! I remember my first, first game was always dying there. Of course. But this was really creative, because it actually, you know, changed the whole mechanics of the game with the, not really, but the low gravity-ness was kind of cool. And I think there's like different biomes you can go to. The sound design's different. Like, I didn't really appreciate it as a kid, as my, you know, my little 15-year-old, 13, 14-year-old self, but kind of cool. That's uh, around about the same. Oh, I remember this. Earth is like visible, isn't it? Somewhere this way? There it is! That is it? That is all you got? Oh, hi! I didn't see you there. Well, this might be very quick. Oh! Why did it give me these? Because I've died? That's crazy! That's the upgraded version. That's the Pack-a-Punch version. Yeah, there's Earth. Hard to see from here. But I remember it from being down there. Lower, on the lower floor. I do remember the easter egg for this though. It was it was very uh, convoluted as they get, of course, although I think it took a day to solve. But it ends up with the earth being blown up, which is pretty rad. The variety in the oh no. Species marvels even Tokyo. Your crib size is so small. Mm -mm -mm -mm. No ammo? Not cool. Not a fan of that. I do not remember how he fights or what he does, but not a fan. <laughs> I like the ragdolling though, that's pretty fun. The silence makes it feel a little awkward though. I just killed myself. No. Oh. Please no. Thanks. I just wanted to blow up res box more. Blocks? Res blocks? What kind of name is that? That someone else's? Like, where did it get that from? Oh, I thought there was, or maybe there was just one biome. Ah, oh, I remember the pyramid being a whole cryptic thing that you could do in, like, Samantha, a little girl appears in the middle or something. You have to, like, put, you have to send zombies here to harvest them into the pyramid at one point. Oh, that's not refill, that's minigun. I forgot the minigun perk. Didn't know that was a thing. There are not enough zombies here to have fun with it. Oops. Alright, I just want to see the rest of the map now. That's what I'm gunning for. Oops. Getting a little lost. Coming up that way, but... Sure. <gasps> oh, yeah! Oh, I still need... I liked this spot, because you could actually be outside again. I liked the outsides more than the insides. And then I think the biome's there. This is a big map. Buds. Oh well, I didn't even hear them. I thought there'd be no chance they'd be popping up. That's all I was aiming for. 
I should have gone the other way. That probably would have actually gotten me there. That's the big biome I remember, yeah. Ah well, apparently one man was my old clan tag that I had for Black Ops. Who knew? I thought it was default because I was playing solo, but I guess not. I don't want to play zombies anymore. We've done the beginning and the end. Let's see if we can, if we can get the final other thing I wanted going on, which was Bad Company 2. Hi! Hello everybody! I played this game all the time on an Xbox 360. I've not played on PC, always wanted to. I want to go on a specific one, I think. Because there's a lot of these levels I think are PC exclusives. Africa Harbor, I think, it was cool. Man, actually, you know, I don't really remember these too well. Like, off the top of my head, I don't remember Laguna. Oh man, these are all kind of weird. Let's go to Africa Harbor, I feel like I remember that. Why not? Uh, we are not going in a squad. You can fight in with 24 players. Ah, oh, thought it was bigger. Then again, maybe 24 was the big number compared to Xbox. Who knows? Um, ah, oh, so because we're playing on PC, my account's all restarted. Um, I remember I used to do Medic a lot. Recon on Bad App, you know what? We'll give it a go. We will give it a good go. I am not a... I am not a classic, uh... Easy to snipe guy, but I will I will try. Uh, there's a quad this this sensitivity is high, but I, that's even the default actually. So I don't know. There are people. Can I like? Oh, this isn't a game. It's just like I could just be here hanging around, I guess. What's going on? Hold on. Maybe I should get the quad, quad bikes probably faster. So like, how does this work? The quality looks nice. Oh, because it's PC. I forget we're not on Xbox 360 anymore. Are you telling me those scoring disabled due to too few players? Ah, you're right. You're kidding me. This game died? No way. I used to love playing this game. If no one's here, I guess I can do this to get see what the rest of the level is. Okay, we got that charge in place. Stand by. Oh man, hearing that voice is nostalgic. This is all nostalgia based, I guess. Can, wow, are they really this close together? Could you not just make them both go off like crazy? Do you like tag it? Oops, that's a grenade. I'm learning the controls. I think we got objective Bravo. Yeah, we got it. I should, can I see the map? That's kind of the map. Oh, whoa. I remember this, I don't remember what it did. I guess it senses people nearby. How do you knife? Ah, was that it? You click in the mouse button? It's not doing anything for me. Oh, it slowly did, okay. Oh, man. Well, this is, this is, I mean, of course it is, this is nostalgic. This is a place I, I wanna come to legitimately. I wanna play this game again. It's really sad if this is like done. Because, like, I don't know, to me, this is like, well, I would say this. I would say this is the best battlefield, but it's like, it has a different vibe to it than what they stuck with, you know? Battlefield's picked up this realistic design, but I, and it's not like this is cartoony, but I love the, the, the weight and the vibiness of this way more. I can't explain it, you know? Just like, and the like destructibility, I mean, I guess that's still in the mod. Maybe I should just play a modern Battlefield game. I've got Battlefield 1 on the PlayStation 5 for free, so we'll see. All right, let's see if we can get ourselves in a game. If not, I guess we're running early. Um, but it looks like this nostalgia stream was awfully nostalgic. I had a lot of technology issues back in the day, but uh, <laughs> it lingers here too. What? What I have done? What am I looking for? What did I do wrong? I honestly cannot tell. I don't believe that it's zero, you know? Otherwise, I just spent 20 pounds and wasted all my money. Who knows? On that note, I will be leaving it off here then, because I've tried a whole bunch of other things. And like the good old days of 2010, everything kind of crashed and burned. I had to rebrand in 2012 to get my foot off the air, off the ground even, into the air on things, and over here it's around about the same. But I hope you enjoyed anyway. Didn't get to play the online horrible world of Modern Warfare 2, but that's kind of a blessing. Didn't get to revisit Halo Reach, which would have been nice, but uh, is always the way, I guess. 
I'll play it in my own time on Xbox at some point. No, I can't because it doesn't have online. The Xbox. I could buy it on PC. It's whatever. And then we played a little bit of zombies. Was well, good fun, but uh, not too much to see when it's just you by yourself. I think that's the point. When I was in 2010, I was a young 14 year old kid. It was a new experience for me that I had so many memories of because it was the first time I upgraded to playing all the time with other people, you know? Nintendo games, while they're great, they, uh, they're oftentimes solo experiences, you know? It was good times 10 years ago. I'm glad to be where I am now, 10 years on from that. On that note, I'll be ending it off here. Next time on Friday, we're going to go through some YouTube shorts. We're going to watch YouTube movies like the short movies and just sort of react to stuff online so hope you join me for that but otherwise i'll leave it off here my name's been daz you don't really care and i'll see you in a bit bye bye everybody <laughs>